But here we are at the east side of the house. We supported a 2x10 spanned across three of the joists. And we got it supported. And now it's holding the weight of the house with that jack right now. So then we came over here and we cut this loose. And as you can see, it's loosey goosey. Rotten too. All right, well, let's take the sawzall and cut down. Wait a minute. What else is here? Yeah, we'll cut down and get them nails out of there and it should pull right out. Here, let's put a shorter blade in it. And you know you ain't gonna hit nothing. And we're gonna work our way down the house and take out 12 foot for today and try to get 12 foot put back in. Alright. Here we are on, uh, what is it, May 20th or 21st, something like that. It's Friday. And this is where we got tore out in Paul Dean's bathroom to uh, prepare the foundation, get the foundation fixed, and uh, remodel his bathroom. So what we're doing here is, you see I got most of the lumber removed from the interior of the bathroom floor. We got a jack, we got a jack right here, holding up this 4x6, which we're going to keep and um, support. And then we got a jack stand here. And that's holding up the kitchen, this first jack stand, where the fridge is. And we got one more, and that's holding where the stove is. And then the outside beam, what we got? Outside beam, we got a jack there holding the outside beam. So we're trying to get everything supported where I can get this piece out here running, the foundation piece here where the Pepsi's sitting. I want to get that piece out and put another 12 foot piece of new meat in there. So that's what we're doing today. We're getting ready to disconnect the water for the old tub. I'm going to pull it back here and cap it at the T. And maybe I'll cap to this T right here on the cold side. Alright. As you can see, we have significant uh, termite damage. All the ceiling's got to come down to inspect the framing on the roof. This ceiling's coming down to inspect the framing on the roof. And then all this is going to get tore out here. The laundry is going to get reworked. And then the water here is behind the plywood there. We're going to rework that whole area and make it more uh, compatible with his washer and dryer. And then we're going to go look tomorrow at Restore. We'll go look at windows and stuff to see what kind of windows we want to put in this wall. Yeah, let's get there. Oh, wait a minute. I got you locked out. Hey, what's up, man? <laughs> As you can see, we got the old outside beam gotten rid of. It's gone. Yeah. Now we're raising up this 4x6 here, get it up off that old brick for the, for tonight. You moving it? Oh yeah. It's coming up? Oh yeah. I just want that to sit solid where we can put the plywood back. Oh, it's going to be solid. And... Hey, I don't know if we can now. Can do this. That's good. That's good. I see it's up off the beam. That's good. What happened when I step on? I don't move much. We do that. See, we got the house pretty tore up here. We're ready to lay all this deck. And that corner is pretty well set, except for a little bit of plumbing. Last one cleaning.
it's like disorientating when you're trying to look through the camera and down at the same time. Gotta take all that out. Thank you. 
What a mess. Oh, look, we can see daylight. That's the outdoors. <laughs> new, uh, new bathroom concept. Mm -hmm. Bringing the outside to the inside. Throw a cat through that wall. I pulled a small cat out of limb strain yesterday. <laughs> you did? Living? No. Big old hairball.